So this one time we're playing Minecraft. Diablo 1 for the PlayStation. Shadow of the Colossus. The Kingdom Hearts series. Mass Effect. The download content for Bioshock Infinite. Half-Life. Final Fantasy VII was the most influential video game of my entire life. I'm like 14 years old. I played it multiple times. And binging for about 30 hours playing this game. I went through it, finished it without sleeping, got done at 10 a.m. It's, it's a pretty spooky game. We love scary games, though. For the butcher in that game, it's, um... When the main girl was getting tortured. Halfway through Final Fantasy VI, all of your friends get lost. And the camera cuts to that shot above, like, kind of above, looking down at this field of flowers and these two characters standing there and it just stays there and nothing really happens and you're kind of waiting for him to do it and then the button prompt pops up in the corner of the screen, that little R1 pops up that like tells you it's, he's not going to do it until you pull the trigger. How do I say this? I had a panic attack during that scene because it scared me so much that I, I dropped the controller and I had to turn the TV off. Did I scream? You screamed. It was oh. like a shriek, like... <laughs> like... I was just blown away by it. It was just a really powerful moment. And from then on, like, that, that was the moment that kind of, like, just lit the spark of, oh, games can do something really unique here, something that no, no other medium can emulate this in a way that I can think of. And by the end of it, I'm just bawling my eyes out, and uh, I just fell in love with everything about it. I'd like this to go on the record that I did not remember. He totally did this scream. Thing, no, yeah. didn't scream. It was funny. It was awesome. And my grandfather, who was an engineer, right afterwards told me that uh, you know you make those games through programming, which he very briefly shown me before that, and uh, I was so amazed by that idea that I decided that's what I wanted to do with my life, and here we are like over 20 years later and I've been in the game industry for 10 years. Which has driven both my, where all my friendships are, my career, even my husband. Met my wife, met my uh, best friends in the entire world. Me and my friend, uh, best friend at the time, played it and uh, one of the big major things of the story is like friendship being like a power, like an internal power and stuff like that. And since we had been friends for so long and playing that game together, it just it really stuck with both of us, and I don't know, it, like, how do I say this? I don't know, like, uh, one of Sora's uh, quotes is, my friends are my power. And so, I guess in a way that's mine too. Any game that really does that kind of thing to you can make you, make, you know, make you have, you know, big macho tears. It's yeah, exactly what you're looking for. And uh, that's my little story.